Okay, uh, hopefully I say everything right in this tutorial. I've actually started to record it three times and I keep <laughs> saying the wrong things because uh, um, I just get them mixed up in my head. But uh, basically let's create a variable here as we have in a previous tutorial. And we'll say hello world. And as we've done in the previous tutorials, we've been working with the case of the letters. We can say echo, and if we just echo out the variable, obviously it's gonna say hello world. But we've learned if we put this into curly braces and do comma comma, it lowercases everything, takes everything and makes it lowercase. And if we do um, the carrots, it makes everything uppercase. Well, recently I discovered that let's say um, let's say our variable was all lowercase. So we're gonna set x equal to hello world all lowercase. And obviously I said if we do carrots, everything's uppercase. But if we do the same thing with one carrot, it actually affects only the first letter in our string. If we go in here and we do, well, let's change the value of our variables again. We'll say x equals hello world all uppercase. If we echo out x and we do a single comma, instead of making everything lowercase, it makes the first character of the entire string lowercase. Now, we can also do the same thing with the tilde, which is uh, on US keyboards, top row to the left of the one on the same uh, key as the back tick. If we hit that, it will actually, in this case, it looks like it's making uh, the first character of each word in the string lowercase, but what it's actually doing is reversing the case. So if we were to change this to be a lowercase w, and we run that, we now have a capital H, and, I'm sorry, lowercase h and a capital W because it's actually reversing the first character of each word in the string. Unlike the using the caret and the uh, comma, which is affecting the first letter in the entire string, this is affecting the first character in each word within the, or each word within the string. Um, and it's not making it capital or lowercase, it's reversing it. We could also uh, do two um, tildes and hit enter. And right now you look at it and what it actually did was it reversed every character, every character's case in the entire string. So let's go in here and we'll change this to lowercase e, lowercase l, we'll make this a lowercase l. So now if we do that, it's printing out the entire string, but reversing the case of every string within, or every character within the string. So as you can see, it get a little confusing. That's why I screwed up the tutorial the first three times I was trying to record it because I just getting it all mixed up in my head. Um, but quickly, let's review. If you echo out the value of the variable, you get the value of the variable. Two commas within these uh, curly braces, it makes everything lowercase. Two carrots, it makes everything uppercase. If we do a single carrot, it will make the first character within the entire string, whether it's capital or lowercase, it will make sure it's capital. If you do a comma, it will make the first character in the entire string uh, lowercase. If we do a single tilde in there, it will make the first letter of each word the opposite of what it is. Uh, so if it's lowercase, it will make it uppercase, and uppercase will make it lowercase for every the first letter of every word in the string. And if you do two of the tildes, it will reverse every character in the string to the opposite case. So uppercase characters go lowercase, and lowercase go uppercase. So I think I said everything right that time. Uh, I sure hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please visit filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. There should be a link in the description. I hope you're enjoying these tutorials, and I hope that you have a great day. Be sure to like this video if you're enjoying these bash tutorials so that I know what you guys like. Thank you for watching and have a great day.